Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for blessing us another wonderful day to enjoy life. Thank you for the sunshine that give us new hope. We would like to start our day with your word O Lord, and ask your Holy Spirit to help us understand thy word O God, for us to be guided in our doings and goings today. Please forgive our sins God, and help us to be worthy to be called your children. This we ask in the most precious name of Jesus Christ our Lord and Savior. Amen. The Waiting Game It's inevitable that a great deal of time in our lives will be spent waiting. We wait for the baby to come, wait for that perfect job, wait in an endless number of long lines, wait for healing, and the list goes on and on. How we deal with all this waiting is very important. The Bible says in Isaiah forty thirty one, But they that wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength. They shall mount up with wings as eagles. They shall run and not be weary, and they shall walk and not faint. God wants us to be patient, for when we run ahead of the Lord and operate on our own timetable, we'll be in trouble every time. But when we wait upon the Lord, it's important to wait trusting in God's perfect timing, and not spend a moment of time worrying about what the future holds. Not knowing what will happen is difficult. Let's face it, being in limbo isn't easy on anyone, as most people want to know what will happen next. But if God showed us the future, there would be no need to trust Him. Sometimes, God's timing takes a lot longer than what we would like. The Bible says in 2 Peter 3, 8, With the Lord a day is like a thousand years, and a thousand years are like a day. The only way to win the waiting game is to have an extra measure of faith. Then we can look forward to whatever He has in store and rejoice always. 